Hey everybody, this is Buddy. Well, I'm leaving off where I continued. <laughs> well, what happened was that uh, uh, Scotty put the back cassette on the bicycle. The back cassette. What he done was he slipped this gear. Now what he's replaced is the chain and this back sprocket right here. Cassette, they call it. Now this front sprocket is when he slipped, he literally, see these sharp edges? See how they look like teeth? They're not supposed to look like, let me get the camera where you can see better. They're not supposed to look like that. They're supposed to fit and not have these sharp, sharp teeth. He put that on at A and B store number two. He put the chain on at the A, A and B bike shop in Springfield, Missouri, store number one. And so when we were at store number two to get the cassette, that's where he was test driving it. And that's where he slipped on the big sprocket. And that's when we come to the conclusion that we've got to have a big sprocket. So he's ordering that now. But I do want to say that, uh, man, the guys at A and B Cycle are really cool to work with. They, uh, they know their parts, they know what they're talking about, and when they make adjustments, you can, you can count on the fact that they know what they're doing. And the, and the, the, the overall product of A and B is, is really, really good. Uh, I, I just, I, I won't go anywhere else. I mean, I might check prices and do things like that and, you know, look at the internet price and do this you know but you can't you can't beat their price a and b cycles is has got it where you know they want your business if you've been riding around like i have changing gears but not really changing and hearing a lot of racket and noise it could be because you need a new chain and a new um cassette on your back sprocket or your front sprocket could be wore out my whole drivetrain was wore out. I have literally put a lot of miles on that bike here recently. And um, I knew it was causing me grief. I should have did this weeks and weeks ago, if not a month ago. But, um, you know, we live and learn. Now what uh, a and Cycles has to do is order me a uh, front sprocket for that. And that's what Scott is doing. So, I'll give you an update on it when it gets completed, but for right now, um, it could take a few more days to get that, that piece in. But it's riding and the power is really good. It's when you push, push, you, you're just feeling really good. But for me to really hammer up hills and stuff where I'm actually really hammering on that big sprocket, I've got to uh, get that replacement before I do. But uh, it's riding good right now, so I know it's going to be riding good with the, that front sprocket fixed. Alright, so if you're like me and you want your bike tuned up to the perfected parts and pieces, and even if it's just tuning the cable, they can do it. They can do it all. They can rebuild a whole drivetrain like they had to do for me because I put so many miles on it. But, so, alright, that's what I'm saying. I'll be back on the road and, and with a new drivetrain and just as soon as that part comes in and he can get me in to put it on. Alright, thanks for watching my channel and click the like button and uh, smash that, what do they call it, oh the bell, yeah hit the bell, smash that like button and uh, leave a comment, <laughs> I always like to read your comments. Well hey everybody, this is Buddy. Well, the sign says gossip runs down more people than cars. Yeah, that's true. Gossip is something else. I personally don't entertain it. Carrying a tail makes a monkey out of you. Well, that's interesting. That means if you carry a tail, 
Like somebody tells you something. He's big on gossiping and taking and telling about tales. He'll be preaching them poor people to death about that. Because <sighs> everybody gossips. I just don't entertain it. I just, if somebody's got something to say and goes off into that, I just change the subject. Or I'll just stop them and tell them, look, I, I don't even want to, I don't even want to know what you're saying. They, they being the other people are doing. Because I don't need to know it. I just don't, I just don't want to do it. So, I'm big on that part of it. Gossip does nobody good. Nobody. But, it's, I heard somebody say one time, gossip was like giving one piece of a, good old chocolate brownie to somebody and you're holding the other piece in your hand and you you know they're gonna ask you for more <laughs> that's they just want more you know dang my bike fell over I guess that's that's a sign that I gotta go or that's a sign <laughs> that the winds blowing look look how hard the damn winds blowing it's blowing so hard I could probably go kiteboard at Table Rock Lake. <laughs> yeah, let me check on that and see if I can do that. All right.